hello youtube today i will show you how to flash stock rom for htc desire u and htc desire v htc desire u is also called a pro mini dios so the files which are needed for this flash is uh, htc sync software if you have uh, drivers you don't need that fast boot CWM recovery image, bootstock image, Android backup, and uh, WinZip. We don't have stock uh, firmware, so we are using an Android backup here. I, I have provided all the links in the description. First step is to on USB debugger, uh, debugging on your respective devices. Go to settings, developer options, click on USB debugging, and stay awake reboot your phone download and install winzip if you don't have winzip software the link is provided below download and install htc sync as i said before download the folders uh, download these folders these uh, files sorry and keep it in a single folder and this the I downloaded this all the folders here. So this folder, uh, namely the Nan Android backup 2014. So copy this, uh, right click this, and add to archive. Re give the zip extensions here, and press OK. I've already done this, so I will not do it again. And I start the fast boot will find this here okay and uh, make sure this all the steps have uh, done neatly all the above steps are done neatly now we will start the flash with proceedings with uh, start the proceedings with the desire v first switch off your mobile in order to enter your bootloader mode to enter the bootloader mode press and hold the both volume button as well as power button until the screen goes completely black once it is black release the power button only do not release the volume but down button you will be booted into the bootloader mode this mode should be working even if your phone is bricked if your phone is bricked then please try this method you will get into the blue bootloader mode now connect the phone to pc via usb make sure you have on the uh, debugging mode or else the PC will not detect your phone. Make sure your phone is detected by PC. Uh, like uh, you will have an uh, dialog box here saying that HTC Desire U is connected to the PC or HTC Desire V is connected to the PC. So now open the fastboot.exe from the extracted folder. Before that, you have to place this CW Im uh, image file in the extracted folder or fastboot this file place this here or else uh, this will not uh, this will not be flashed now open fastboot.exe if your phone is connected it will uh, uh, definitely open I will show as I have as I don't have the device now, so I will show you in command prompt. Now type the following command in fast boot. Press enter. When it says finished, reboot the phone. Transfer the 2000. Uh, 14 one uh, an android backup file to sd card you can do this without rebooting if your uh, re rebooting if your phone is bricked uh, uh, just remove the sd card and with the help of card reader put this zip file into your phone now reboot the phone again in bootloader mode go to recovery mode using volume brown as navigation button and press but uh, press power button to ok it will be redirected to recovery mode. In this mode, wipe Dalby cache, wipe all data factory reset, under mounts menu format internal SD card, not the external SD card. 
format a system uh, format system and don't format uh, don't for uh, don't uh, format sd card please then select flash zip from sd card navigate to mm, uh, zip file that you have put just now and press ok wait till the zip file installs yes that's it your desire is now flashed with stock rom if it is not then continue this procedure or else uh, try to download the boot image uh, desire v boot image and flash it in the same way as we did for this recovery mode okay for desire users um, same procedure is followed till now and uh, the bluetooth and wi-fi will not be working for this we follow uh, the below procedures reboot the phone in bootloader mode as we did before place the boot uh, bootstock dc image in the file extracted folder in the fast boot here place this file in here now open the fastboot.exe from extracted folder I'll type following command in the cmd this command is different from that so copy and paste it wait till it shows finish reboot your phone boom your device uh, your desire is as good as new this method is 100% working please leave comments if you have doubts like and subscribe if you if it helped you thank you